Sirius Cap's parachute system had another save. So I want to know if anybody's familiar with that system or has flown the Sirius SR-22, but we're going to go over the crash. Let's check it out. So look at that, just gracefully gliding through the air. That's what you like to see. No injuries. There's two people on board. You can see they landed in this Lake Murray on Thursday at about 1.45 p.m. They started having engine trouble. But this was a Cirrus SR-22, November 879, Charlie Delta, the tail number. And they left from Greenville Downtown Airport. And this is in South Carolina. And then you can see they ended up near Taylor's Cove Road and this Lake Murray. And they were wet and cold. So, you know, as a firefighter, you want to get them out of the water, make sure they're safe, warm them up, get them dry. Because, you know, you want to check them for injuries. There was none. But you also want to check their mental status. You know, they just went through a crash, even though they landed very safely. It's still traumatic. And then also, you want to um, make sure that you avoid hypothermia. And, you know, check those things as well. Get them checked to the hospital. Here's police on scene. And then here's the aircraft. And then I remember there was another one from July 3rd, if you guys remember. So that pilot survived the crash. That was from July 3rd where he used his SR-22's um, CAPS parachute. So if you want to check that out, there's the video here. Please like and subscribe. Hit the globe. This is Arfro. I'm Keone, and I'll see you guys next time.